morning, not just like Japan, not just uh, Jamaican, vegan. Morning, morning, morning. Thank you for coming on the show. Well, this morning going to be a very, very cold morning. You know what I mean? When I went, when I, when I went outside, all that it was just white, like white paint. So the only thing come to my mind is to make some porridge and drink a nice lovely cup of tea. Right? That's the only two things come to my mind this morning. Is porridge and a hot cup of tea. Jackie, good morning. Good afternoon. How you been? You alright? Join my YouTube channel membership, guys. Anyway, this morning when I wake up and I look outside, it was white like white. And only thing come to my mind, I say I have some green banana left over. And I said to myself, I know I did a, a banana porridge a couple of days ago with um, oats. And I said, you know, I'm going to make a straight banana porridge in the morning. Yeah. If you wake up this morning, all right, guys, listen to me. If you wake up this morning and you look outside through your window and you see everywhere is white like paint, tell me what you're going to do. Put that in the description box. Thank you so much for coming to Chef Ricardo Cooking Show this morning. I'm going to show you how you can make authentic Jamaican green banana porridge <laughs> all night last night I'm telling you it was it's like everywhere is white like paint so if you wake up this morning and you look through your window and you go in your kitchen and you said to yourself greetings good morning how you been you alright Sharon good morning if you look through your window this morning and you see everywhere is white are you going to go in the kitchen and make fried dumpling and akia saltfish? There's no way you want to do that. There's no way. There's no way you want to go into the kitchen and make aki and saltfish and fried dumpling. I would never do that this morning. The first thing I will be doing into my, for myself this morning is get myself a lemon. Um... This one is a vitamin C. This is the tea bag. Because I don't have any fruits. If I have fruits, I would make mine. This is vitamin C. Alright. As I said, if you wake up this morning and you look through your window. Alright guys, honestly. And if you tell me that you are not going to go in the kitchen and make something to boot up your immune system. Uh, no, no, no. Something definitely wrong with you. Alright. But I'm telling you this. You have to. Make something to boost your immune system this morning. Alright? Please share the video. Please tell a friend. And a friend tell a friend. Alright. Now, this morning as I said, when I wake up and I look through my window, it was white like paint. And the only thing come to my mind is to go in the kitchen right now and grab myself a vitamin C. Listen guys, vitamin C. This is vitamin C. It got different kind of fruits in help. Is that understand? Help. It said help to support your immune system. All right. Very good. Now what I'm going to do? I'm going to make a very strong one. So I'm going to be using two tea bags inside of mine. All right. Honestly, it's got to be half as strong. <laughs> I don't know about you this morning, but I'm telling you, if you wake up this morning and you go in your kitchen and talk about you're going to make toasted bread and all these things. That's a big, massive red flag. Alright. Get some hot water ready. And all them things there. And pour it upon it like that. Fantastic and amazing. Secondly, get yourself some lemon or lime. And just squeezing it like this. If you wake up this morning and you're not doing something like this. That is a massive red flag. Big, big, big red flag, guys. I'm telling you this. 100% it is a... Big, big, big red flag. All right, squeeze some lemon juice or lime juice in inside of it, just like this. This is what you want to do this morning. If you wake up this morning, and you definitely, I don't, if unless you are in Jamaica or you are into a, a country where very hot, you, you know what I mean. And if you're still in a country where very hot, you need to do something like this. No one of them to boost your immune system. All right. Nice one. So this is what you see I'm doing right here. Alright. I got two tea bags and some lemon juice in this. Alright. 
that smell really nice. All right, the thing I want to simply say to you, you don't have to make porridge. You can make whatever you want to make. But this morning when we wake up, I said to myself, Jano Star, I got some banana left over. I got three more finger. Look at this one, fresh and nice. All right, some green banana. All right, and I said to myself, say, you know what? The only thing come to my mind this morning is to make some porridge. You can make pan porridge, you can make banana porridge, you can make car meal porridge, you can make oats porridge. Do not go in the kitchen and go fry the plant and go eat a toast. Alright, drink a nice lovely hot cup of tea. And probably I'll later on you make us some pot, some soup. Alright, look at that. Beautiful cup of tea. Alright, so yeah, as you can see, well, wherever you are, if you are in London or wherever you are at the moment, it doesn't matter where you are. I'm just simply saying to you, if you live in a country where when you wake up and you look through your window, it's be a white, you see. Do not go in the kitchen and go toast or bread. That's laziness. You, you're lazy. You need to go in the kitchen and make some porridge or make a nice lovely cup of tea like this and boots up your immune system, build up your immune system and all these things. Alright? You see how this looks nice already? Yeah. Yeah. This is exactly what I'm talking about. So basically, if you, as I said, you wake up this morning and you look through your window and everywhere is white, do not go in the kitchen and go do not toast and fry an egg and all them things there. You're lazy. All right? You need to get up and do something. Make some porridge or some soup and all them things there and boots up your immune system. All right, now we're going to make some porridge. All right, got like three finger loves it. Three nice lovely fingers of green banana right here. We're going to make straight banana porridge this morning. All right? 100% straight green banana porridge. We're not going to add nothing to it. We're just going to make straight banana porridge. All right? And I want you to do this at home. Later on, you can make us uh, some soup. You know? Because, honestly, this is kind of way that uh, will lick you down and make you sick and make you stay in your bed and can't move. All right? You park up like a car. So, you don't want to do that. So, what you want to do? You want to make sure do this in the morning. Beautiful one, as you can see. Anyway, welcome back. So we got the Caribbean fusion, Caribbean fusion sauce and spice. That's what we're going to be using this morning. You can get this on the website. If you look down in the description box, the website link is in the description box. You use the code Chef Ricardo Cooking, then you get a 50% off. All right. So please, 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 please do this with me, Chef Ricardo, this morning. All right. Now, the thing why I want to simply say to you, as I said, if you wake up this morning and you go in your kitchen and fry egg, if you live in London, you are very lazy. Honestly, no matter how much work you have to do, no matter what you have to do this morning, you have to go in the kitchen and build yourself a nice, lovely in your boots up. Boots up your body with this. Yeah. Mm. That is delicious 100 percent that is delicious i love that all right so basically we got three fingers of green plant green banana and that's what we're going to do this morning green banana straight green banana we're going to use all right so what you want to do make sure you wear gloves when you're going to remove the skin from the banana all right because you know banana is a little bit stainy Steal up your finger and all them things that you don't want to do that. So you make sure you wear gloves. Alright guys. Alright, so that's the right there. And we got that right there. As I said, this morning when I look through my window, everywhere is white. And the only one to come to my mind is to go in the kitchen and do something like this. Honestly. So, yeah. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to simply remove the skin from the banana. That is very easy to do. Alright. To be honest, I could make some Aki and Sawfish this morning. Aki and Sawfish can boot up your body in the time of kind of way. So this is one fingers of the planting banana. So you just want a simple cut them up. Put it straight inside of it. Alright. Just three fingers of green banana. That's what you need in the morning. So we got one finger up ready. Alright. 
if you wake up this morning and you look through your and uh, see that the white paint <laughs> and you're talking about you want to go in the kitchen and make fried dumpling no 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 way you want to do that you want to make sure boot up especially if you're going outside for work and you look through your window last night and see how these weather no you have to boot by the guys 100 percent you have to all right there's a big trouble you will be parking up at home and this is what i always say to yourself if you don't look after yourself someone will take a position at work all right and it's reality that i'm telling you so remember this if you're in a full-time job and you are earning good money all right make sure you look after yourself because when you're sick then i will call somebody else to take your space all right because nobody not gonna wait till you get better for you to come he said yes we're gonna wait a lot till you get better so basically as i said if you're in a good job at home and you're working look after yourself all right because when you look after yourself then you will see the result all right guys but anyway we're not gonna be going there we're gonna talking about this morning all the weather is look outside and some people want to go in the kitchen and do some toasting and fried egg no 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 red flag no toasting this morning and fried egg all right this morning you have to drink some porridge and some good lemonade or some garlic tea or some peppermint tea and boots up your body and as i said if you are in a good job and you're earning good money look after yourself because when you're sick your manager now gonna wait till you get better then i'm gonna call the agents if you make somebody full of space so you better like make sure you look after yourself at home all right that is lovely and beautiful and nice look at that fantastic and an amazing now the thing what i want to simply say to you we got we got two fingers of green banana inside of this right here so what we're going to do is get some almond milk because i like to use almond milk all right we're going to put a little bit of almond milk in it and blend it up with some almond milk all right nice one and this is my nice lovely cup of tea i say if you wake up this morning Go in the kitchen and make yourself a ginger tea, lemon tea, lime tea, or peppermint tea, or green tea, and drink it. Because this is a kind of weather, yeah? We lock you down like a car. Park up, can't move. Because this is a weather, you not play. Alright, now we're going to make a little bit of noise. Nice one. So just blend it so what i'm going to do now i'm going to get the next fingers of green banana and put it straight inside of it all right because so remember when you're doing the blending you have to be careful because you know it's not a large blender it's a very small blender so you have to do it this kind of way so if you wake up this morning guys and you see that outside is white please look after yourself don't take no check. Please look after yourself. We're gonna blend this some more. So turn on your phone. size pot all right lovely medium size pot and as i said we're going to make green banana porridge we're not gonna add any oats any cornmeal or anything to it we're gonna make it straight green banana porridge so as i say if you wake up this morning and you go in the kitchen and you're gonna fry egg and you're going to fry uh you're gonna do toast and having a cup of coffee that is a red flag all right because the kind of weather we have right now you need some energy you need to boots up your body if you don't boots up your body 
and build up your immune system, you will shut down. Alright? And when you shut down, and you're in a good job, your manager not going to wait for you. Somebody going to take your space. So you have to look after yourself. At home. Alright? Unless you're a millionaire. Alright, now, medium size pot on the stove, like this. Alright, you need a medium size pot. So we just blend three fingers of green banana. You can get green banana in the local shop to buy, alright? Alright, now the thing is, sometimes you're definitely hard to get green banana where you are. You don't, but to be honest, you don't need to fly to another country to get green banana. It's all local in your supermarket, in your local markets. Alright, lovely and nice. Now what we're going to do is... We're going to put a little bit, roughly about a cup of hot water inside of this pot right here. One cup of hot water because I boiled my kettle, so I'm going to use hot water. Alright. Then nextly, we're going to add some coconut milk. Because you have to have coconut milk right in this porridge. You can't nah, make the porridge and not have no coconut milk in it. You have to have coconut milk, alright. So we're going to put roughly about quarter cans of coconut milk. Alright, so you got coconut milk, we got a cup of hot water, and we blend three medium size green banana. Alright, you can make peanut porridge, or you can make oats porridge, or you can make also um, American porridge and all this kind of porridge. American, that's going to take long in the kitchen. So stick to something simple and do it at home all right cheers guys so go in the kitchen and make yourself a lemon tea and boots up your body right now with some ginger and all the thing there all right you need the energy in your body you need to boots your body all right that's good mm -hmm. nice one look at that so basically as you can see it's not a lot inside of it all right just a little bit that is lovely all right natural jamaican i have to nice boiling okay all right nice one thank you so much for that like um coming on the show all right as i said the only thing i'm just simply saying to you guys you don't have to do it but to be honest with you it's just amazing to know what you can do at home all right because a lot of people may wake up this morning and to be honest with you when they wake up this morning and go in the kitchen and the first thing they're going to do is make a cup of coffee and then they, they run go outside and play with the snow. Alright? But then and look the effect where it may come after. Yes, you understand? You have to look after yourself and make sure that if you're even gonna go in the snow, you make sure you make sure you have a nice lovely hot cup of tea or something to boost your immune system. Alright? Are uh, they gonna fry some egg? Or uh, probably, you know what I mean? Make a toast, two slices of toast, and run out down play. Red flag. That is a big, big, massive red flag. Alright? As I said before, you may in a one proper job, very, very good job. And to be honest, you may just run out into the snow and you know what I mean, you capture a cold or a flu or something. You know what I mean? Because of the kind of weather right now, the time is cool. You have to be careful with the hot and cool. So you know what I mean? You're in the warm house, you run out into the cool. You have, in the cool, you have to be careful. And you ain't even wrapped up good. No matter if you're young, no matter if you're old, no matter who you are, you can sick because we are not iron. Alright? We are human beings. So that's what I'm saying. This morning, for all of the ladies and the man them who like for just rush in the kitchen and just make a, like, a two slices of toast, red flag. Alright? You go in the kitchen and you want to make a fried egg, Red flag. You go in the kitchen and you want to, you know what I mean, make some Jamaican caramel dumpling and all them things there. Red flag. All of them then are the morning, them there are red flag. You want to go in the kitchen and make yourself a hot cup of tea, lemon tea, ginger tea, green tea, or peppermint tea, whatever kind of tea. But something like this and boots up your immune system. Alright? Then you make some porridge. Something will warm for going to your stomach, into your tummy. You know what I mean? When that going to your tummy, it helps to build your immune system. Alright, guys? Yeah.
Yeah, I may sound like a negative person, but I'm telling you, all of these things is positive, guys. Drink out some garlic tea. Yes, all them things that we are talking about. Anyway, let's go into some business now. So basically, this is the that fantastic and an amazing. Look at this. I'm going to show you exactly what I'm going on right now. So this is a tree. Beautiful um, green banana we just blend. All right. So it look. Yeah, we use almond milk and blend it. All right. So what we're going to do, we're going to scrape it right into the pot. Like this. All right. Try and have less liquid in the, in the, into the pot. A lot of people may allergic to water and all them things there and allergic to, to green banana and all them stuff there. But if you're allergic to any of these things, just try and work around it, alright? So we want to give it a whisk. And that is lovely. Alright, that is just amazing. So basically, what you want to do, you don't want to have a lot of liquid in the pot. You want to have less liquid in the pot. That means uh, when you put in the, the, in, the ingredients into it, it can come together and bind it together. All right. So remember, don't have too much liquid in the pot. All right. So as I said, try and boot up your immune system with a drink before you go outside this morning. Because honestly. When I look through my window, everywhere is white. And the only thing come to my mind, yeah, I could go and fry some fry plantain, ackee and salt fish and all them stuff there. And I said, no, that is a big red flag. All right? You need to boot up your inium system and make inside of your tummy warm. Just like when you start your car in the morning, you turn on the heat after to get the car warm. You can't drive in a warm cold car for three hours. There's no way. So basically, that's what you need to do with your body. You need to just turn on the engine in your body and warm up your body with some nice, lovely tea like this right here. Anyway, there's a special giveaway on my Instagram page right now. If you're following Chef Ricardo on Instagram, all right, for all of the ladies and who love to cook spicy food, win it and give your husband and tell him to cook you some spicy food for Valentine. So please go over to Chef Ricardo hashtag and win this Valentine present. Alright. So as you can see, you have to keep your eye on the part because you don't want it to get too lumpy and all that stuff there. So yeah, as you can see, this is how the green banana part look. It's very easy guys, very very easy. And if you can use whatever kind of milk you like to use, it doesn't matter what kind of milk. You just get yourself some green banana, go in the kitchen and make this, alright? Look at that. So you get thick now, alright? Look at that, or you get thick. So if you get a little bit too thick, you don't need to worry yourself because you can correct it. But it's when you got too much liquid in the pot, you can't correct it. Alright? So when it's like this, it's very easy to correct. Secondly, you can just get a little bit more of the almond milk and just pour it in the pot like this. Alright? And then you keep your eye on it. When you see thick like this, it's very, very easy to correct. Alright? So what you want to do, you just keep adding a little bit more. Look at that. You see it? That's so you can correct yourself when you're cooking. Just like if you're cooking at home and you put too much salt in the pot, it will salt, so you can't correct it. You take a little time and you keep adding a bit of salt a bit at a time until you get it perfect. Alright? So as you can see, so we can add a little bit more almond milk. And that is lovely and nice. Look at that. Beautiful. And you don't want it too runny either. You want it right between. Alright? Because if it's too runny. You're not feeding baby, you know what I mean? You're other, so you don't want it too runny. You want it perfect. Nice one. So we still can add a little bit more, same way, until we get it perfect. So basically, if you wake up this morning, this is what you want to do. You want to 
want to go in the kitchen and make this honestly once I go in the kitchen and I make this add a little bit more so this is what I want to say to you if you're making this at home this is the best way to do it I'm telling you guys especially if you're the first time you're going to make it do not have a lot of liquid in the pot because it will spoil and you can't correct it all right now this is perfect all right we're gonna leave it like this look at that smooth and nice all right so we're going to make this cook for a period of time all right so what you want to do is make sure you cover it so once you cover it you lower it and make it cook all right and lovely this morning as I said this morning guys if you wake up this morning and you look through your window please do not go in the kitchen and do any toast or fry any egg that is a red flag in the morning like this you want to go in the kitchen and boots up your body first thing in the morning you know the first thing in the morning a lot of people do they check their phone and then check the TV if you saw go on and you look through your window so when you look through the window you see a whole of white mist there you go back into the kitchen and say, no, there's no way you're going to do that. <laughs> you just go back in the kitchen and make something like this. All right? Yeah. Beautiful one. Mm. Ah, and you don't need any sugar or any honey. Beautiful. You see that? Look how it's there. And amazing. Yeah. Now we make it go and cook. All right? That is fantastic and an amazing. So... Shout out to every one of you guys who are watching so far. And you know what I mean? Respect goes to every one of you. What I want you to do is, yes, Pauline. Paula, Paula, Pauline, or Paula. That is very, that is a very, very healthy part you have in the morning for breakfast. Honestly. No fried egg this morning. Red flag. And also, no toasted a slice with a piece of cheese. Red flag. Make a big pot of porridge. Have it for lunch and breakfast. Alright, and boots up your body. That's what you need to do. So right now the part is cooking as you can see it for yourself over there. Alright. As you can see, that is just amazing. Alright guys, so yeah, we got a lot more recipe and also we got a lot more things will be coming from Chef Ricardo. So as I said, please tell a friend and a friend tell a friend. Alright. Yeah. Please tell a friend and a friend tell a friend. The only thing I would say to you this morning is please, please, please go over to my Instagram page and follow Chef Ricardo. Alright, that is very important to follow Chef Ricardo. Alright. Can I see what's going on right there? Alright, I can see what's going on. Look, it's cooking. Beautiful. And when it's cooking like that, to be honest, I need to see. When it's cooking like that, guys, honestly, it is just very, very easy. Very easy to, you know what I mean, to deal with at home. Yeah, very, very easy. All right. So what we're going to do now is simple. Look what we're going to do now is take a check at it. So make sure when you're taking off the pot, the lid, you know, when you're taking off the lid and you want to give it a spin, look how it ticks here we are. You see how it tick? But at the same time, I do it spite of it, the thickness like this, yeah? You still can add a little bit more. Almond milk, but you don't you have to be careful because you don't want it to, you know. Sometimes when you go to the shop, you see people them them when they buy porridge, it's just running like a water. No, it's not supposed to be running like a water, it's supposed to be right in between. Runny and just smooth and nice. But as I said, this is what you want it to look like. Ah, this is perfect. You see that? Very, very perfect. Because you're not feeding baby, you know. 
<laughs> I mean, if you're feeding baby, that's different. But as I said, this is how you want the parch to look beautiful and nice. So when you add the rest of the ingredients, then it's gonna see it just really look different and nice. All right. As I said, if you wake up this morning and you're going to the kitchen, this is what you want to make a perfect bowl of porridge. All right. Mm -hmm. Ah, that is lovely. That tea is amazing. All right, that is fantastic. Anyway, guys, please, please go over to my Instagram page, Emergency. This is Emergency, cause you know we got a special giveaway for all of the lovers them who love to, you know, what I mean, cook at home, cook some spicy food, and all these things. All right. So basically, if you make a a pot of porridge like this, what you wanna do when you wake up in the morning and you make a big pot of porridge, you wanna like all this a kind of way that now you wanna save some for dinner for lunch all right you have some in the morning for breakfast and have some for lunch then later on you make a nice little vegetable soup vegetable soup later on that's what you need to make because the vegetable soup definitely going to just boost it up and give you exactly what you need all right so as i say if you wake up this morning and you go in the kitchen and you tell yourself that okay i'm going to um fry egg there's no there's no frying egg this morning all right you have to go in the kitchen make yourself a nice lovely good cup of tea and after you make a cup of tea then you know say hold on there who's this hold on there first graces okay thank you so much my darling yes graces world i want you to check out gracie I want you to check out our YouTube channel. Our YouTube channel is amazing. I think she's doing a great, great, great job over there. All right. As I said, check out our YouTube channel and she's doing a fantastic job over there. Okay, cool. Thank you so much. Afternoon. All right, England. Can you join my... Okay. The in... Okay, the ingredients and the metal. Okay, all right. Check out Gracie. Thank you so much for that one point. It's amazing. One point. So if you wake up this morning and you look through the window, Gracie, please do not go in the kitchen and, you know what I mean, make any fried dumpling, any um, ackee and saltfish and all them things. You need to go in the kitchen this morning and make yourself a beautiful, fantastic bowl of green banana porridge. Alright, the green banana porridge is very easy to make, you know what I mean, banana is cheap, and, uh, you can't get green banana. I don't think anyone need to fly to Jamaica and I quarantine you to get green banana. You know, so basically you can get green banana at the, the market, supermarket, or, you know, your local shop. So what you want to do is get three fingers of banana and about roughly two, about, about two cups of milk, almond milk I'm using, and I use some water, sweet condensed milk, a lot of stuff going to happen right here. Please do not put any jerk seasoning inside of the porridge because that is red flag, alright? Yeah. Green banana, it is, is this banana planting, all of these things guys, make can make at home. So, check out, check out, check out Gracie YouTube channel, thank you so much for that. Please join my YouTube channel membership and support Chef Ricardo, alright? Because we have a lot more recipes and ideas coming for you guys, 100%. So, yeah, please... Please, 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 please check out the YouTube channel. All right? Please. We got a lot of recipes and a lot of things coming for you. As I can see it for yourself. All right? Now, let's take a look over here and see what's going on. Now, Mikael, you have to make it cook. All right? You need to. Beautiful. See how that look nice? That's exactly what we're talking about. Look at that. Beautiful one. Fantastic and amazing, guys. Alright, so you need, you see? Once it cook, my guys, honestly. Once that cook, you are good to go. Once it cook, you're perfect. 100 percent That is just lovely. As I said, this morning you wake up, you need to make something like this, guys. Honestly, do not go in the kitchen 
I make the coffee and all these things. Get some lemon and some ginger and make even just be a lemon and lit if you even want to put a little bit of honey in it, but boots up your immune system, alright? We love and all. Mm -hmm. This one is a um this one is a boots of immune system tea bag I'm using. Very good with some lime juice in it. Wow, this is amazing. You see that? You wanna drink this before you You wanna drink this before you eat anything in the morning. Yeah. Beautiful one. Oh, that is lovely. I love it. As I said guys, this morning you wake up. Yeah. You need to. You need to you need to build. You need to boots up your immune system guys all right thank you so much for that one pound gracie thank you so much it's amazing 100 percent. thank you so much and honestly if you wake up this morning trust me guys you need to just jump into the kitchen and make yourself some nice lovely lovely porridge all right because what happened now the porridge definitely help to boot your immune system all right Rej, thank you so much. Ah, oh, oh my days, Gracie, you're welcome to my club, my my. Thank you so much for your support. You know what I mean? As I said, she's amazing. You know what I mean? I follow her on her YouTube channel, and she is amazing. She's doing some great, great job over there in the kitchen. Some powerful cooking. So guys, support our YouTube channel, honestly, because I go over to her channel and I support her a lot. So please, please, please support gracie with our cooking all right thank you so much to join my youtube channel membership and she also donate a one pound to chef ricardo cooking we can buy more green banana and we can buy some more ingredients all right thank you so much for that we're doing a very hard work and it's not easy and as i said you know what i mean thank you so much for being a member of chef ricardo youtube channel one love we appreciate it all right we can see you are big welcome to my membership. Thank you so much. You are amazing. And as I said this morning, if you wake up, just try and make yourself a nice, lovely hot cup of lemon tea or some ginger tea or something to energize your body. Because we all know that this kind of weather is not that easy weather. Yeah? This weather can make you park up like a car in a garage. Can't move. All right. Yeah, I'm happy to be here. It's so th you're welcome, my darling. You're welcome. You're welcome. Big, 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 massive welcome to our family on YouTube right here. Welcome. So that's what I'm saying, guys. Please join the YouTube channel membership and support Chef Ricardo. You don't have to join it for one year, two year, three year. You can join it for two months, one month, six months, whatever time. You know what I mean? And just support Chef Ricardo and the cooking program. All right? As I can smell that beautiful and an amazing porridge making this morning it is fantastic yeah all right so we're just gonna make this boil and boil and boil until we get it really perfect all right thank you so much gracie you are amazing please check out our youtube channel and you know what i mean follow her and support her go over and subscribe to our youtube channel and support her all right it is a, is a she's amazing cook over there 100 percent all right look at this guys whoa Beautiful. That's exactly what we are talking about. This is lovely. So what you want to do? Give it a whisk. Alright. Look at that. So this is why I'm saying when you're making the porridge, turn off that because this is cooking now. You know what I mean? It's not, we're not boiling iron. <laughs> but I'm telling you, green banana porridge, green planting porridge. We're talking about peanut porridge, caramel porridge. If you wake up this morning and you look through your window and you tell yourself you're going to go into the kitchen and make fry egg and make a toast, red flag. It's a massive red flag that I think you need to come off the pitch instantly. Go in the kitchen this morning, honestly, and make yourself some banana. If you don't have any banana, tell your husband to bring some banana. Come and make your, your some planting and make some porridge. Then later on in the evening, you make some soup. 
no overnight rice and peas were left back from yesterday. Give the kids them that because the kids them can play it out. Adult, you can't burn it out because a lockdown and probably not even exercise at home. You're at home just watching TV and mocking about, you know what I mean, with the phone and all them stuff there. So, remember, porridge in the morning and later on we're going to do soup. Alright, we're going to make a little vegetable soup later on. I'll be doing live on that one because today is meat free Monday. With Chef Ricardo, alright? So, if you wake up this morning and you look through your window, if you live in Canada, US, England, Jamaica, if you're in Jamaica you wake up this morning and you see a beer white out there, you need to do something like this, alright? Now, salt, stand to sweeten. Alright, we're gonna put a little bit of salt and we're using sea salt, which is very important. And you can use pink salt, alright? Now, it's two things you can do. You can use organic honey or brown sugar to sweeten your porridge. Alright, I'm just going to be using my, you know what I mean, my sweet condensed milk. Lovely and nice. Now, the Jamaica, the Caribbean, no, man, the Caribbean, Caribbean fusion sauce and spice. This one, yeah, to be honest with you, this one, yeah, it's got everything in it already. And you don't need to grate or anything. And you don't need to go to the shop and buy four or five different items. When one thing have everything in it. Alright, so this is just central for you. Where it's very handy and easy to use at home. In the description box, there's a link where you can click on. You can go over and get their product. Their product is amazing. They got all different kind of stuff over there. They got their own jerk season. Marinating your meat and all them stuff there. Which as you can see, this is amazing. Alright, got a lot of stuff coming up. So if you go over there on their website, you can see exactly what they have over there, alright? So as I said, guys, to be fair with you, I don't know who you are or where you are or where you're from. Or who, you know what I mean? If you're a millionaire, if you are rich, if you are poor, if you're a middle class, wherever you are, you still have to look after yourself. You have to eat healthy, alright? And as I said, if you are in Jamaica and you wake up this morning and you see snow falling outside lock the window and lock the door them and stay inside and make yourself some porridge and, and boots up yourself with some inium system with some you know what i mean nice lovely all right some lovely ginger tea and thing there because we always have ginger with us no matter who you are all right what we're going to do we're going to put one teaspoon of this amazing essence sp spice mix right here inside of the porridge let's put a little bit more just a little bit more. Beautiful. Alright. Please go over to my Instagram page. And please support Chef Ricardo by following Chef Ricardo. You can win that Valentine present for all of the ladies who love to cook spicy food. Because I know a lot of ladies like cook spicy food. So, hashtag Chef Ricardo on Instagram. Look at that purge. So that look nice and, and amazing. Alright. So remember, as I said before, guys, if you at home and you know what I mean, as I said, do not cook anything like this this morning. Now, um, we're gonna put a tablespoon of vanilla. Nice one. Let's put a little bit more. Beautiful. All right. That is fantastic and an amazing. Shout out to everyone at your grace. Thank you so much. For joining my YouTube channel membership. Guys, sometime I will be doing video for members only. Alright? If you are not a member, you're not going to see the video. I have to support my members them also. Because they support me right straight through the year. We got members that did that for 2 three years. So sometime I have to support my members them by doing a video special for them. And tell them that I'm a really appreciate it. Alright? We only go only for... 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 for um, members only because i have a weight loss special weight loss recipe coming up for members tomorrow which i'm going to be doing that video only members alone gonna be able to see the video you're not gonna be able to see the video like how you're seeing it now like i'm trying my best to say guys support chef ricardo join the youtube channel membership and you know what i mean super chat whatever you have or uh, you can pay for a one pound or 50p doesn't matter what you have all right Anyway, we got some vanilla essence. We're going to put a teaspoon. Alright, nice one. 
So it's all about supporting, all right? Support Chef Ricardo, because I'm telling you, we will be doing video for members only. Tomorrow morning, I will be doing a live, and it's going to go for members only. Members first will be seeing that video, then it will, it will go to the audience, all right? So, look at that. So that look nice. As I said, if you wake up this morning, you need to go in the kitchen and make something like this. Do not go in the kitchen and tell yourself you want to make a slice of toast and put a piece of cheese on it and then you're going to sit down back in front of the TV. Red flag. Alright? You need to get up this morning, go in the kitchen, do a little bit of exercise like making some nice lovely porridge or something. Alright? Now we're going to make some, we're going to get some sweet condensed milk. Sweet condensed milk. And when we get the sweet condensed milk, what we're going to do is sweeten it by the goes on, alright? So what we're going to do now is add a little bit of sweet condensed milk, not too much, because we're going to taste and sweeten as we goes on, alright? Look at that. So you're going to change the color completely and give it that beautiful creamy look. And you can use brown sugar if you want, or you can use um, organic honey. It doesn't matter what you want to use, it's up to you. Look at that, beautiful and nice. When you wake up in the morning, this is what you need to have. Something amazing like this, guys. Honestly. Alright, now let's see what's going on right here. Let's taste it. Alright. Wow. You know what happened? I like it that way. Not too sweet. Not a lot of salt and all them stuff there. It's just right in between. Alright? Beautiful. So what we're going to do, we're just going to cook it for about 5 more minutes. And then we... Serve it up, all right? Yeah. Five more minutes and then we serve it up. Beautiful and simple and also delicious, all right? Tell a friend and a friend, tell a friend. Gracie, good morning. Thank you so much for joining my YouTube channel membership. Okay, are we there? What time is it that in the UK? Okay, I will be there. What time? Okay, Gracie, tomorrow morning, um, let's see what time we're going to be doing this. Sometimes I start them like 11 o'clock or 12 o'clock during the day. You know what I mean? Because sometimes we got the U.S. citizens who also support Chef Ricardo. You know what I mean? We have to support them also. Alright? So basically, as I said, this morning we're making the porridge. Alright? Later on, we can do a little bit of a vegetable soup. We don't know meat and we don't, you know, if you put no chicken or anything. Yeah. Just a little bit of vegetable soup because of the kind of weather we are in at the moment. All right? The weather is what I'm talking about. Because a lot of people may wake up this morning and see outside look white and nice and then just rush go through the door and then even drink a hot cup of tea. And I said to you, my audience, if you wake up in the morning and you go in your car and don't start the engine and turn on the heater, Oh, your car gonna get warm. That's the question I want you to tell me. So it's just like your body, okay? When you wake up in the morning, yeah, you make yourself a nice, lovely hot cup of a lemon tea or some ginger tea or some orange tea or some whatever kind of tea. And once you do that, then you warm up your body, then you go outside and turn on your car and turn on your eater. I want you to tell me if I'm talking something right or wrong. Please tell me, all right? Anybody in this world, go look outside now at the moment and see outside, oh, it's so cool. And if you go outside and you turn on your car, you have to turn on the heater in your car. So why you cannot drink a hot cup of lemon tea or some ginger tea or something to warm up your immune system before you go out into the cool? Anyway, if I'm talking something wrong, please write it in the description box make others can see it all right guys because i like to learn gracie thank you so much for joining my youtube channel membership please check out our youtube channel k gold big up yourself thank you so much for coming on the show this morning it is fantastic and an amazing and as i say if you're living in jamaica and you wake up this morning and you see outside white like london then what you need to do is step back in the side and you know make sure you look up all right Tressa, uh, Tressa, thank you so much for coming on. All right, and you know it's just one of these things, guys. You have to, you have to look after yourself. All right, it's not like you don't have, you have to. All right, 
RJ, RJ, big up yourself. Thank you so much for coming on the show. Yes, it is so cold. All right, so if it is so cold right now in the inside, remember outside right now. You know what I mean? As I say, you have to wrap, wrap up yourself, and once you wrap up yourself, yeah, once you wrap up yourself, then you'll be all right, one hundred percent. This is what I want. Beautiful. Look at that. So it's cooking slowly. All right, let's turn off here and let that eat for it to cook it. All right. So if you wake up this morning and you look outside, all right, and when you look outside, you see that cool, yeah, you need to decide what you're going to do for the day. Because I'm telling you this, there's no way under hurt you're just going to go outside and make yourself, you have to warm up yourself, guys. And you know what I mean? It's not only just put on big jacket and big expensive coat and all them things that that alone is not enough. Because what about the inside of your body? You know what I mean? You have to look after your inside of your body. Where you know that you know the inside is very important for you to keep it warm. Alright? Yeah. So So it's very important guys that you know what I mean you look after yourself and you know. And, and make sure you are pretty good at home. Please do not just step out of the door and go outside. Alright? Yeah, mess, um, today is going to be meat-free Monday. I want to do a little bit of soup later on. Vegetable soup. Alright, so look forward for it. A little bit of vegetable soup later on. Meat-free Monday. Let's see what's going on over here. Alright, we're going to have meat-free Monday. So look forward for that. Please join my YouTube channel membership and support me my youtube channel gracie thank you so much for coming on the show this morning and thank you for the support all right it is amazing check out our youtube channel she's doing really great over there you know what i mean she's doing some fantastic job our food is amazing all right so go over and subscribe and take some time over there on our youtube channel all right so all right so thank johnson good morning thank you so much it's amazing to be in the kitchen this morning we make this fantastic and an amazing green banana porridge. Beautiful. What more do you want when you wake up this morning? Anyone in if if, if you are from Jamaica or you live in Jamaica right now and you wake up this morning and you see snow fall in Jamaica, I'm telling you this. Go back in, lock the door. <laughs> I don't think anyone would want to come out. Everyone will be locking the door. <laughs> But anyway, as I said, if you wake up and you see outside white this morning, to be fair with you, do not go out there. Please don't follow any anyone because you are not iron. You are human being. Alright? Beautiful one. Thank you so much for coming on the show this morning with Chef Ricardo. And as I said, thank you so much, Gracie. You are amazing. Alright? Things going to look nice now. Alright? Yeah, so what you want to do is simple, you know what I mean, yeah, do it like this way, and this is exactly what Chef Ricardo and I'm going to do in the morning when we make porridge, alright, simple like this, nice lovely bowl of a porridge, alright, this is not kids thing, this is big man thing, alright, nice bowl of porridge, alright, just like that, beautiful, nice and lovely. That's, that's exactly what you want to have. Then, what you want to do? Get some crackers. You know? Get some Jamaican Excelsior crackers right on top of it like that. And as I say, it doesn't matter where you are in this country right now, to be honest with you. Look at that. Alright? And when, once you do that, also what you can do is, you know what I mean, you know Chef Ricardo love his seeds, alright? So what we're going to do also this morning is put a little bit of our seeds, alright? Thank you so much. This is some sunflower seeds in the porridge, alright? Some people might say, Jamaican doesn't do that. Because sometimes Jamaican then doesn't take the time and read and look into things, you know what I mean? We Jamaican, we just 
say things that we want to say but sunflower seed and all these things is very good for you it's like a protein you know what i mean extra protein all right so if you want a little bit of extra protein you don't have to eat meat to get protein you can you know you can also eat some nuts and all them stuff there and some pumpkin seed what about pumpkin seed yeah we have some pumpkin seed i'm gonna put a little bit of pumpkin seed please check out gracie world youtube channel you know what i mean she's a big fan of chef ricardo so support me right straight through the year and to be honest with you guys support her join our youtube channel yeah all right that is some pumpkin seed right here pumpkin seed is very good for you 100 percent that is like an extra protein all right so what we're going to do now is get some chai seeds all right if you get a little bit of the chai seeds and a simple you know what i mean yeah beautiful look at that yeah you don't have to to be honest with you you do not have to you know what i mean a lot of people might just say oh i'm not, jamaican doesn't put this on their porridge that's not jamaican style okay it's not jamaican style because jamaican we jamaican doesn't understand that pumpkin seed and all them stuff they give you protein they're very good for you and all that stuff sunflower oil sunflower seed is very 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 good for you all right so if you take the time and do a little bit of research because we all have smartphone very expensive phone you know what i mean take your time go on your phone and you type in what's the benefit for green banana what's the benefit for you know what i mean whatever you, you want to make at home but anyway cut the story short remember Go over to my Instagram page. There's a giveaway for all of the ladies who like to cook spicy food. You can win this. All right? 100% you can win this. All right? So if you go over to my Instagram page right now, hashtag Chef Ricardo Cooking, you can win a Valentine present. Win it and can give your husband and tell him to cook you some spicy food for Valentine. All right? Ladies, they need to do some work. All right? Now, we got this one. Caribbean Fusions. This is a master and roast roasted and grilled seasoning 18 different herbs in this do not use this in the porridge all right red flag all right guys we got also some jerk season you can get on this on the website if you go to caribbean fusion sauce and spices.com its link is in the description box do not use this in the porridge red flag all right guys and as i say if you wake up this morning and you look through your window and you see beer white Please do not go in the kitchen and make any fried egg or any toast. That's a red flag, all right? Because some of the ladies are very lazy, you know, they sit in front of the TV, don't want to do nothing. But not only the ladies, some of the man them too. The man them just sit down and no one make nothing for the ladies. You have to look after your ladies in the house, all right? So basically, go into the house, into the kitchen, and make some porridge. And, you know what I mean? Bring a nice, lovely bowl of porridge for your missus if you are. What you need to do is just boots up your immune system with a nice lovely hot cup of a lemon tea or ginger tea or you know what i mean peppermint tea or some green tea once you do that then if you want to go out into the snow then that's it because there's no way you're gonna jump into your car and start a car and don't turn on the heater you have to warm up and eat your car yeah sometimes you stay in your house and start all your car all right yeah you start out a car and then you 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 know. Okay, some experts have said so sunflower seed, yeah, uh, uh, pumpkin seed get rid of, of pressure. All right, them thing there. See, so there's a lot of protein right just going on. So I know I mean uh, if you if you re, if you do some research, you know what I mean just a little bit of research. Look what some people's writing in the description box, guys. You know what I mean. <laughs> so I need to go and see what's going on over here. All right, <laughs> what are the first? All right. No, if you're going, if you look what some people write in the description box, you know what I mean. As I said, pumpkin seed and all them things are very good for you. Boots up your immune system, honestly. And as one hundred percent as I can see, exactly what's going on in the kitchen, guys. That is just lovely, delicious, and an amazing. All right. But the thing I want to simply say to you this morning. A lot of people may wake up this morning and just run outside. Alright, because I'm excited because 
them see the snow and all them thing there. That's a red flag, all right? Think before you go outside because, as I said before earlier this morning, you may be in an expensive job. And may I tell you this, no matter what kind of job you have, if you're sick, your manager going to call the agents if you get someone to come in. You're not going to wait for you until you get better. So that's why I said to you this morning, make sure you look after yourself before you're going to the cool. All right? If you wake up this morning and you look outside, warm up your body with a hot cup of tea because when you drink a hot cup of tea in the morning it is very good for you all right yeah share cage big up yourself thank you so much for coming on the show thank you so much for that million love heart and all them stuff to share cage. you always support me all the dash, you know what i mean support me right straight through um rj thank you so much for coming on the show all right uh, so Grace, check out our YouTube channel. She's doing really great over there with a lot of different kind of recipe. All right, guys. As I said, you have to think before you do action in the morning. All right. As I said, do not go outside and decide you want to um Xavier, uh, X Xavier, or whatever X Xavier. Thank you so much for coming on the show, Sunflower Seed and. Oh, uh, yeah, it's very good for... That's what I'm saying, you know? Yeah. Food. Food fun. Okay, all right. Thank you so much. I love the eat porridge. Okay, nice one. Yeah, I, I, oh, yeah. Thank you so much for coming on the show this morning. You know what I mean? Nice to see you again and again and again. All right? Yeah, nice one. Yeah. Food fun, eat. Food fun and... All right. Food fun, check out his YouTube channel also. You know what I mean? You can join Chef Ricardo um, membership. All right, go over to my Instagram page. All right. Lovely, my friend. Yeah, thank you so much. Your cooking is good and lovely. Thank you so much. Food fun. Thank you so much for coming on the show. Um, go over to my Instagram page right now. And if you go over to my Instagram page, there's a giveaway. There is a massive giveaway right now on my Instagram page. For all of the ladies them all like to cook healthy food and spicy food you know what i mean win it and bring it to you your missus at home and make you cook some spicy food because sometimes you know what i mean the man them have to do something at home you know what i mean some of the man them lazy you know yeah they need to just get up and do some some work in the kitchen you know what i mean and just make the lady them alone while cook and all them thing there it doesn't fear so get up Go in the kitchen and make some food. Later on, we're going to make soup. Yeah, this is so delicious. Thank you, Gracie. All right, thank you so much for coming on the show. Please check out Gracie World YouTube channel. It is fantastic, and I'm a big fan of their channel, and I support them 100% because you know what happened. We have to learn from one another. No matter who you are, we always have to learn. All right, because when you, the more you learn, is the more it's better for you. Yeah. Hey again, big up yourself. Thank you so much. That is amazing. All right. And as I said, big up yourself, Master Chef. Greetings from East London. All right. Welcome to the East London crew. Thank you so much for coming on the show. Um, I must say to you this morning that if you wake up this morning and you see this white miss, please make yourself a hot, nice, lovely hot cup of a ginger tea or lemon tea if you even make something this morning earlier the next cup of tea where you want to make make sure it's something where warm up your stomach you know what i mean like you can build up your immune system like a vitamin c or a vitamin b don't go down to nothing else stick to them there right now at the moment because then they're very very good for the body all right so as i wake up this morning guys are you going to the kitchen please make yourself something fantastic all right yeah something fun all right winston big up yourself thank you so much for coming on this morning please please go over to my instagram page hashtag chef ricardo cooking follow me and someone definitely can win this amazing valentine present all right all of the ladies them who love to cook spicy food and love spicy food all right 
win it and bring it to your husband at home and tell him to cook you some food. Don't say that Chef Ricardo never put up something. Alright? So, if you like spicy food, go over to my Instagram page and win this one. Alright? You're welcome, Gracie. Thank you so much. Remember to check out our YouTube channel. Alright? Gracie World. Check out our YouTube channel. And she's doing a fantastic and an amazing job over there right now. Alright? So, go over and support her and subscribe to our YouTube channel because our recipe them is amazing. Honestly. And not only that, I love the recipe them because I, went, I was using one the other day. Fantastic and amazing. Pamela, Pamela, thank you so much for coming on the show. Thank you so much. You're amazing. No matter where you are, from or where you're from or where you, where you are, welcome on the show. Please go over to my Instagram page and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And, you know what I mean, as I said, there is a special giveaway over there for all of the ladies and more like spicy food. Spice up your Valentine with some spicy food, you know what I mean, some rice and peas and some jerk chicken and some jerk lamb chops and some, you know what I mean, yeah, you name it, all of them, the spicy wing chops and all those things, yeah, go over emergency right now and someone can win this Valentine, we only have a few more days left for Valentine, alright, so yeah, please go over and win this Valentine present, alright, yeah. Here's the same. Big up yourself. Thank you so much for coming on the show. Alright. Uh, my IG name is Chef Ricardo Cooking. Hashtag Chef Ricardo. C H E F R I C A R D O. And then Cooking. C O O K I N G. Hashtag everything Chef Ricardo Cooking. Alright. You go over. Here's the same. Big up yourself. Thank you so much. Big up yourself one more time. You're a big supporter, Chef Ricardo. Also, here's the same. Go over to Gracie World Channel and support her. Alright. Yeah, go over to Gracie World channel, YouTube channel, and support her. She's doing really, really fantastic over there. Uh, so, she's doing an amazing job. Alright? So, check out our YouTube channel also. Alright? Oscar, Oscar, Oscar. Yeah, Oscar. What did you eat? <laughs> Oscar, what did you eat? Uh, um, as I said, um, um, okay. Alright, yeah, yeah, check out our YouTube channel, man. Ask, yeah, yeah, yeah. Check out our YouTube channel. She's doing really amazing over there, you know. I mean, you're a person who support a lot of us on our YouTube channel right straight through the year. I me mean, see you last year, right straight through the year last year. So, yeah, big up yourself. Donna, she's a member of my YouTube channel. Check out our YouTube channel also. Alright, fantastic and an amazing. Alright. That's exactly what we are talking about. Check out our YouTube channel. Welcome to the membership, Dana. You are amazing. Thank you so, for, so much for the support. And, you know, yeah. And also, Dana, check out um, Gracie Royal YouTube channel. She is amazing. Yeah. Oh, those red, red, great. Oh, yeah, yeah. And IG. Yeah, that's my YouTube channel. That's my IG page. Go over and follow Chef Ricardo. All right? Follow me over there. And honestly, someone can, someone have to win this present. It's a must. <laughs> it is, we're giving away this present. Someone has to win it. So you need to win this present, guys. All right? Um, all right. Mama. Mama, Royal Kitchen. Um, all right, Mama, thank you so much. Keep up the good work, Chef. Thank you so much for coming on the show. It's amazing, Mama. Big up yourself. Thank you so much. As I said, check out Gracie, Royal Kitchen, and Donna. X Thompson, please check out, welcome to my YouTube channel, that's membership, that's the most important thing, what we are talking about right here, alright, please check out the YouTube channel, it is fantastic over there, and it is amazing, alright, yeah, Meg, big up yourself, thank you so much, I love the spicy food, well, if you love the spicy food, <laughs> if you love the spicy food, go over, to my Instagram page and hashtag Chef Ricardo Cooking, you may you may win this spicy all the spicy sauce and thing there. All right, remember to check out the Caribbean Fusion sauce and spices. They are located in the United States of America, and they are you know what I mean supporting your local business in your area, and that is very nice to support your local business. Honestly, 
Um, yeah. Yeah, support your local business in your area. Alright, so go over in my description box in this video. There are all the information how to get their season. And there's they got all different kind of season. Got jerk season, got all different. And also they are gluten free and also vegan friendly. And that's the most important thing with this season. Alright, so check out their season and you know what I mean. Yeah, support your black local business in your area, all right? That's how we can do it at the moment, all right? So remember, check out Gracie YouTube channel, Dana and Mama, you kick Mama, check out their YouTube channel also and support them. Please, guys, it's all about support, all right? Once you can support one another, then the platform can build like a massive team, all right? All right, so, <laughs> host, how <laughs> about you eating tonight? Okay. Okay, um, <laughs> well, all right, what we want to say is for tonight, all right, I may do um, a vegetable soup later on because of the kind of weather which we are in at the moment, yeah, the kind of weather which we are in at the moment, we need to, we need to eat healthy, all right, because honestly, Pamela, thank you so much for joining the, the follow me on Instagram, it's amazing, all right, as I said, there is a giveaway on my Instagram page right now, all right? And that giveaway is for Valentine. So basically, if you are a lover who would like to eat a lot of spicy food, if you love spicy food, this coming really handy for you, all right? Trust me. So go over to my Go over to my Instagram page right now and follow Chef Ricardo. Hashtag Chef Ricardo Cooking. Alright? Trust me. Go over and follow Chef Ricardo. Check out Mama Rest Kitchen, Mama Restaurant, and so I go on and over there. Alright? And support the YouTube channel. Alright? So go over and support Chef Ricardo on Instagram. Someone have to win this and an amazing, amazing one today. Alright? Class is. 622 all right welcome to the show as i said go over to my instagram page right now hashtag chef ricardo cooking um we will be doing a soup vegetable soup later on if you are interested in chef ricardo vegetable soup without any meat today is meat free monday all right meat free monday you have to do something like this all right meat free monday no meat but the thing is, it's just because outside is a little bit cool at the moment. So basically, you can't cook any any food. Alright, classes. Alright. So go back to my Instagram page. All of the ladies that would like to cook spicy food. Win this and can go give your husband or your boyfriend and your house and say, cook me some spicy food for funny time. Because remember, then don't make them lock up the money in their pocket. They can't get for go. Uh, the restaurant because a lockdown all right tell them to cook you some spicy food all right tell them to cook you some spicy food then can't get the chance to go to the to the restaurant because the restaurant them is closed so all of the man them who are going to try to hide the money for this valentine and talk about the rough and tough treat your missus with some lovely food at home all right Village, big up yourself. Thank you so much for coming on the show. It is amazing to see Village, alright? <laughs> anyway, as I said, the Village food. Alright, check it out. Check out the YouTube. Check out Gracie World YouTube channel. Alright, they are doing really fantastic. Mama Restaurant over there. Check out our food store, sir. Alright, food fun. Come up back again. Follow them. Tag them and follow them. Alright, follow them on the Instagram page and the Facebook page. Alright? And remember, guys, to check out the Caribbean Fusion season. The information is in the description box. Please tell a friend and a friend tell a friend. All right, Village, thank you so much for coming on the show. It is amazing. Thank you so much for, you know what I mean, coming on this morning. All right? So, as I said, check out their YouTube channel and support them. Audrey, Audrey, Audrey thank you so much for coming on. All right, you're just, just you're, all right. Someone just did an Instagram and my IG. All right, check out the IG, guys. Over there, some giveaway right now. 
giveaway, 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 giveaway for Valentine. If you love cook spicy food, honestly, this is coming handy for you at home. Someone have to win it. Someone have to take this present. All right. So. All right. Love Jones. Thank you so much for coming on the show, and thank you so much for following me and my IG over there. All right. Thank you so much. It is amazing to follow me and support me over there. All right. It is just one of these things what we have to do at home. All right. Thank you so much. Over. Thank you so much for coming on the show. Um, remember, food fund. Thank you so much. Hope I win. All right. Yeah. You never know. Someone have to win. You know what I mean? Someone definitely have to win this amazing present right there. All right. Look at that an amazing parch. As I said, please, please, guys, go over to my Instagram page and follow Chef Ricardo. Remember, I use this an amazing spice here. This is from the Caribbean Fusion Sauce and Spices that come. The information is in the display of this video. All right. As you can see, this is an amazing porridge. See the porridge that I get all cold and all them things about. You know what I mean? So this is how you see how your porridge must look when you make the real authentic Jamaican porridge. All right? It's supposed to be looking like this. So if this morning you wake up and you go into your kitchen, all right, wherever you are, if you are in Jamaica right now, if you are in Jamaica watching this video and you look through your window and you didn't see any sun this morning, sun rising all over the sea and all them things that, you see, be a white cinema. Lock back the window and they do everything. And rush into the kitchen and make yourself a nice, lovely cup of porridge. Because we always have par we always have things in the kitchen. You can make oats porridge. You can make oats porridge. Carmel porridge. You can make Amanecon porridge. You can make peanut porridge. You can make green banana porridge. You can make carmel. Whatever kind of porridge. Lock up the door and just rush back into the house, into the kitchen. And make yourself a nice, lovely cup of ginger tea. A lemon tea or whatever kind of tea, yeah, even some apple cider vinegar tea, you know what I mean? Yeah, as I said, look at that. Amazing, guys, this morning in the kitchen with Chef Ricardo. Beautiful, delicious, and I know that someone definitely will enjoy this porridge. All right, thank you so much for watching Chef Ricardo. And as I said, we have thousands of recipes will be coming, you know what I mean? Thousand, thousand, thousand. All right. Food fun, yes, and love Jones, thank you so much for coming on the show. Make yourself some ginger tea this morning and boots up your immune system. Alright, that's exactly what you're talking about. Alright, this one is for, this one. This is the one I drink this morning. Vitamin C. Alright, vitamin C. This is very good for you. Alright, to be honest with you. Um, also, this one also very good where you can also drink. Alright, this is very, very good. It's on the Caribbean Fusion Sauce and Spices. All the information. If you want to get this one, it's in the description box. Lemon Flight. Alright, wicked. <laughs> Stay a fly out here in the sky. Alright, this is amazing. Original. Everything inside of it. And, and honestly, you know that lemon is very, very good for the body. 100%. Alright, check out this one also. Very, very, very good for you. This one. All right, so next one we're going to make is this one coming very soon from Chef Ricardo. All right, but this one also very good for you. Vitamin C. This is very good. You know what I mean? Help to support your immune system. All right. Yeah. If you don't want to do this one, if you don't want to do this one, this kind of way, you can get yourself some orange and some lemon. All right, some orange and lemon, and then what you do? Cut it and make sure you wash it. Wash it very good and then cut it up into some slices and pour hot water upon it and drink it with some lemon juice and some ginger powder or fresh ginger. Alright? You can get also some tomato and make a nice lovely cup of tomato tea also. Guys, honestly, right now, to be honest, you just have to look after yourself at home. Alright? Thank you so much for tuning to Chef Ricardo's show this morning. We've got a lot more recipes and a lot more ideas. Alright, Mama? Thank you so much for coming out this morning. And support. Remember, check out Gracie World Kitchen. Support her over there. Subscribe to her YouTube channel. She's an amazing cook. And, you know what I mean? Our food is beautiful over there, guys. 100%. The food is fantastic and amazing. Alright?
please, please subscribe to the YouTube channel. Follow me on Instagram and my Facebook page, Chef Ricardo Cooking. Instagram, Chef Ricardo. Instagram, Anjo. Thank you so much for coming on. Yummy, yummy. Thank you so much. Um, yeah. Thank you so much for coming on the show. As I said, please go over to my Instagram page, hashtag Chef Ricardo Cooking, and support us over there. All right? And as I said, there's a special giveaway for all of the ladies that will love to cook spicy food. You know what I mean? Because some ladies like spicy food. Some ladies doesn't like. So all of the ladies doesn't would like to have the food mildly. Mild. We have mild sauce. We got all different kind of things on the website too. All right. So big up on us, sir. Thank you so much for tuning in. And honestly, this evening we're going to be doing a fantastic, lovely, delicious vegetable soup. Meat free Monday today, guys. Meat free Monday. And a meat free Monday, we do not cook meat. Alright? If you left some food for me yesterday, give the kids them it. Alright? Please give the kids them to eat. Because on a Monday, we do not cook meat. We do a meat free Monday. Alright? That will be starting roughly about 5 o'clock this evening. Alright? 5 o'clock. 5 to 6 o'clock this evening. That's going to be like midday in the US. Alright? So, guys, if you are interested in my Meat Free Monday, let me know. Because we all know that sometimes you have to have a day where you don't eat no meat at your house. At your home. You know what I mean? You can't just wake up every day Monday to Sunday and I eat beer meat. You have to have one day in the house where you say, you don't know what happened. There's no meat going to cook in the house today. Alright? Um, what time that soup will be starting? Probably about 5 o'clock, 6 o'clock England time this evening. You know? Yeah, that's the time I normally start. No, 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 but probably about 6 o'clock this evening. That's the, the English time. 6 o'clock I will be clocking on with that soup. Alright? And probably I'll do that soup for just for members only. You know what I mean? Because I have to support my members then. Alright? So I may, I may do it for the audience and I might do it for members only. So it all depends how much members join on my YouTube channel today. So if I have uh, like another two more members coming on, then I say, okay. That vegetable soup. So if you're going to make the vegetable soup today, please go to your shop and make sure you get some celery. Because celery is very good for your soup when you make it at home. Alright? If you want to make a simple celery, sweet potato, normal potato, and carrot. It's very important for your soup. Alright? We're just going to make a simple little soup at home, which is going to be vegetable soup. You have to do this, guys. You cannot wake up every single day and eat meat. Too much meat does not good for you. Processed meat. Alright? Remember, these are processed meat. It's not like in the Caribbean where you go to the where you can get organic. Where you can get organic meat. These are processed meat. They put water up in them and pump them up and all them things there uh, so as chemical. Guys, I'm telling you this. No. If you don't want to listen to what I'm saying to you, it's up to you. You cannot eat meat every single day. You must choose something different. So today is my meat-free Monday, okay? I don't eat Monday meat on a Monday. I try to eat vegetables or drink some vegetable soup. I eat some vegetable stew or something, alright? But the weather is bad outside, so we decided to do soup today, okay? So, if you are local, go to the shop, buy yourself some vegetable, and come home and make some vegetable soup. Alright? If you left some food from Sunday, give the kids them. The kids them can run it out and play up and down and talk of out for the day. You as an adult, you must look into yourself and say, you have to make choice for yourself. You know what I mean? You're not a baby. You're an adult. Get in the kitchen, get some vegetable, chop up some vegetable, and make some vegetable soup. Alright? Remember, the meat them are processed meat. You might have said, I'm telling lie. Do your research. You got smartphone. Do your research. Alright? Alright? So, watching from Ireland. Okay, thank you so much. But as I said, guys, you have to look after yourself. Nothing wrong by treating yourself, eating a little bit of meat now and then. But remember, these are processed meat and sometimes you have to cut off of these kind of meat and, you know what I mean, eat some vegetable. Alright? 
vegetable is very 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 good for you all right one day can kill you one day out of the whole week all right one day cannot eat can can kill you you know what i mean sometimes you say today you eat fish tomorrow you eat fish again or probably you may eat um we call this one prawn or whatever but one day can kill you where you can say to yourself you know what i'm gonna go in the kitchen today and i'm gonna make some vegetable soup or i'm gonna make a vegetable stew or something like that this gets you have to treat yourself you know what i mean just like when you you go and you buy a phone i say you buy an iphone 13 or iphone 14 you're gonna want to put a case on it and you're gonna want to put a um a screen protector on it okay can you say to yourself you don't want it to drop and break you want to make sure it's okay it's just like your body you know what i mean you have to put a case over your body to protect your body to protect yourself you know what i mean eating some vegetables and you know and sometimes it is very good for you to also i'm going to give you another little bit of secret it is very because so much processed things going on sometimes it is this is very good for you for you to just wake up in the morning and drink one cup of lime tea and do not eat anything until 12 o'clock to kill some of the things inside of your immune system all right don't eat anything till about 12 1 o'clock during the day during the day 12 1 o'clock you drink like a smoothie or you drink another hot cup of tea sometimes you don't eat for six hours to kill some of those bacteria inside of your stomach they are real thing guys all right these are real thing Get a piece of meat and leave it in your kitchen for three days and see what happened. Just leave it on the counter in your kitchen for three days. If you even cook it and put it right there and leave it for three days, it's still going to spoil. All right? It's just like that. When you eat something and it go inside your immune system, it's turning to something different. I'm not going to be explaining that because I'm not, gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm not a doctor or anything. But if you do a little bit of research... Then you can see exactly what I'm talking about. Anything you put into your body, it always turns into something different. Alright? So, that's what I'm saying. You have to look after yourself. And sometimes it's very good for you. Like this morning when I wake up, I eat one fingers of banana. And I drink a hot cup of inium tea, inium, inium tea vitamin C. And then, then I'm going to drink some porridge. And then later on, you can have a little bit of soup. Alright, so these are the way you can do it sometime. And you know what I mean? Sometimes you just have to just treat yourself, guys. It does not difficult. It's just we. You know what I mean? You have to say to yourself, you know what happened? I listen to what Chef Ricardo was saying. And I'm gonna be doing this at home and see. You're not you're not gonna be perfect, but today I'm gonna be doing a meat free Monday. I'm just gonna eat some vegetable and drink some vegetable liquid water and all them stuff there. Um you know what I mean, just treat myself for the day. Alright? But anyway, guys, as I said, it's just a little bit of tips and ideas for you. What you can do at home. And to be honest, it does not complicate. It's very easy and simple. It's just you have to look into yourself and, you know what I mean, do something. I'm just going to say to my, just I'm just trying to say to my people, you know what I mean, look after yourself. You know what I mean? If you look after yourself, there's no way you can go wrong. Just like your car or your phone or whatever you have. If you look after it, it will be alright. And when you don't look after certain things, it's not going to be alright. Alright? So, just like your body. You look after your, your body, you'll be alright. It's what you put in, come out on the outside. Alright? This is just from Chef Ricardo this morning. A little bit of tips and ideas. And as I said, please check out the Caribbean Fusion sauce and spices. They are doing really great. Their season is fantastic. All the link and information is in the description box. Please tell a friend and a friend tell a friend. Alright? So, Please, please check out my Instagram page. There's a lot of ladies like to cook spicy food. And to be honest, when they are cooking the spicy food, they like to use spicy sauce and all them things there. So please check out that on my Instagram page and support Chef Ricard, alright? And we can do a mighty great work, alright? So if you like what I'm saying, guys, please tell a friend and a friend tell a friend. Shalisha, big up yourself. Thank you so much for coming on the show. Um, you know what I mean? As I said. Yeah, hello, dear friend. Um, nice sharing, stay connecting with you, dear friend. Alright, God bless you. Big likes. Tear. 
connecting and see you around. All right, thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for that one. Shalisha, thank you so much. Go over to my Instagram page and follow me. All right. It's just a little bit of tips and ideas, guys. I'm sharing with you where I know that sometime you have to have one day in the week where you just eat vegetables. All right. It doesn't, it can be any day. It can be Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, any time of the day, of the week, you can just say to yourself, this is going to be, um, a vegetable day for just for you and probably for your partner. You know, I mean, the kids them they you, you can try try it with the kids and see if they will like it. If they doesn't like it, do not force it on them. You know what I mean? Cause they're young. You know what I mean? They will burn out things very quickly and easy. You know what I mean? As I said, very very quickly and easy. All right. Um, Chef Ricardo cooking on my IG. On my IG, um, you on my IG. All right. All right, Shelly. Chef, if you go to my Instagram page and you type in Chef Ricardo cooking, then hashtag Chef Ricardo, then that's me over there. All right. So as I can see, guys, please look after yourself at home. And if you wake up this morning and you look through your window or whatever, you will see that amazing white snow outside. So just do not just rush into the snow and just say out to yourself, okay, this is beautiful because we don't see snow for a very long time. Do not just, just rush into it. Try and warm up your body first, all right? Warm up your body and warm up your immune system and make sure you are ready to go outside. All right, guys? It's just a little bit of tips and ideas I'm sharing with you. You do not have to follow what Chef Ricardo is saying, all right? I not found it some in Jamaica. Um, now, what I'm saying, if you, if you once you go on my IG and you type in Chef Ricardo, hashtag Chef Ricardo cooking, you definitely will find that one. Or on my on my dashboard there is the link up on my dashboard chef uh, my instagram ig and my dashboard are in the description box if you look in the description box you can find it all right i know i know it's a little bit difficult because you know that's all right surely you don't take a little time take it easy um yeah that would be nice if you can win that present also you know someone have to win that present but you just don't know who. <laughs> i'm talking about the okay okay in jamaica okay okay all right mm, sorry thank you so much then all right sorry about that yeah so as i said guys honestly um yeah looking delicious dm max all right thank you so much thank you so much thank you so much thank you so much as i said you know what i mean it's just a little bit of tips and ideas for you this morning guys that we can have one day after week meat free monday all right it doesn't have to be Monday. It can be any day of the week. You want to choose to make your meat free Monday. You just you have to choose one day and make it meat free Monday. Because a lot of people does know this kind of meat where we eat in it here is processed meat. And processed meat does not good for the body. Alright, to be honest with you. It doesn't good. So you know what I mean? It's and like you are in Jamaica or in the Caribbean where you can get some organic meat where you know the farmer them the farmer them prepare them 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 fall and them animal proper. You understand? And I pump up no chemical and up and up and make them in a two weeks time. Tell me now, can you imagine in two weeks time you got chicken, a beer ten thousand chicken, 